10 points from the last possible 12 as he Forest Green lift themselves out of the bottom two. A 1-0 up with just over 10 minutes to go last week. Rovers would have backed themselves to make it four league wins on the bounce, but a Crawley equaliser denied them. Today they find themselves up against a crew side, just one point and one place better off in the table. The Railwayman's recent form has been poor, with last week's 4-1 reverse against Lincoln completing a hat-trick of league losses. Grant for Crew. That's a decent ball in. And there's the opening goal. Porter springing in, planting his head on it and making it 1-0. It was a nice ball whipped in from the right-hand side. Got a perfect view of it. Into a really good area. And there was Porter arriving with a really snappy header. Cooper just jigs back onto his left foot, flat and quick. As soon as he got that on target, really, there was no chance at all for Collins in the Forest Green goal. Oh, that misty kind of rain that's been drenching everywhere up and down the country today. It's making this surface really, really slick, whipped into the near post and a bit of desperate defending there from Forest Green again. Long ball, nodded back by Crew. Had the better of this one so far. Anyway, Forest Green though might be able to get something moving here possibly. Osborne was waiting for a ball back, didn't get it. Marsh Brown goes wide to the far side instead, and a bit of space in the right-hand side of the box here maybe, but the attempted cross was blocked. Although that's careless from Crew. They're struggling to clear their lines at the moment. Marsh Brown again. Traore. Ball just flicked up to the edge of the 18 yard box. They're not being quite positive enough around the edge of that penalty area, Forest Green, for me at the minute. It's good football though. And there's the shot at the end of it. But finds the goalkeeper. Jakovici, Osborne, Brown, again good possession, shouldn't criticise it because this is the way the game's supposed to be played but they could possibly just be a little bit more direct at times, ball into the far post and maybe they have been here, well there's the equaliser and Deutsch will definitely claim it because I think it might actually be going wide but a shot came in with some real force behind it and he just managed to stick his knee on the end of it I think and it flew into the roof of the net in the driving rain I described it as misty rain earlier it's turned into a bit of a downpour since then slashing shot and I think that is going wide isn't it from Laird but Deutsch like all good goal scorers reacted just hung to the far post the ball just slowing down on the surface a bit now it's had that much rain I don't think this fixture's in any danger of not being completed although the goalkeeper has made a terrible hash of that and crew should really be back ahead no real route out there Collins, Forest Green keeper just lumps that forward. Bit of a mistake there from Crew. The player went down. The referee wasn't interested. Looked a decent shout, I have to say. Bowery. Still Bowery. Grant. Pickering. Run. 
Grant. He's got Pickering outside. Good football from Tree. That was, that was a lively ball to take. It was straight in his throat, but did really well to keep it under control. Dagnall. Cooper. Still Cooper. Over to the far post. Could be a goal here for Crew, and it is. And it's a number 10 who pounced on the near post there. I don't think it was the cleanest strike he's ever hit in his life, but it doesn't matter. It's a good build-up play, knocked down at the far stick, and there he was to capitalise on it. Cooper does well here. Nodded down, and he's just pulled out and found a touch of space, and he scuffed it a bit, but it's gone in, so it doesn't make any difference. Entertaining game. Got a good kind of passing rhythm going here, crew. Dagnall. Again, that's good stuff, good play. Forest Green working hard to try and get the ball back. It's not proving to be an easy thing to do. Could be another one here. And some pretty desperate defending. Sees Forest Green survive that scare at least. There could be another one coming. That's a free kick every day of the week on the edge of the box there. And it's in a good position too. Yellow card, no surprise. Well, very well suited to a right footed player this. Just enough room to get it up and down, you would say. Walker is on it through the wall and straight into the arms of the keeper. Well, that could cause all sorts of problems when the ball goes through that many players. They will feel at the moment, crew, all their supporters, their, their staff, that this period of dominance they're enjoying here needs to be converted into goals, that single goal advantage at the moment. Brown for Forest Green. Neat bit of play. And that was very nearly the equaliser. Very nearly. Richards. up the one two and plays forward here for Forest Green that's a nice little nick inside the fullback need a delivery into the box here looking for the corner and well it was a cross come shot and nobody could get onto the end of it Forest Green just having a, a spell of their own here they needed one shot from distance and it almost resulted in a goal. It was most definitely an attempt on goal initially. And there is the equaliser, in fact. And it's Doidge again who has got it. And again, it came from a fairly unlikely avenue in terms of the build-up. But the ball into the near post there was good. Good flat ball. And this is really up for grabs now, two apiece. Well, here's a really good chance. Couldn't get any real power on the flicked header. Well, into added on time. And it's been good to watch. Crew really dominated in the, well, opening half of the, the second half at least. But Forest Green are coming to the fore towards the end of the match. And it's going to be a corner. Players striding forward. Driving rain still. Teasing one just whipped up. It's hit the inside of the post and it's ended up going in. And it's Jakovic. 
who leads the charge. I don't think they're going to catch him. And Forest Green have won it. I don't think there's any doubt about that now. It's too late in the piece for Crew to do anything about this. It's a good ball in. Teasing, hanging ball, and it was attacked. Initial header, it's the inside of the post. He got up really, really well, really well. Just lumped forward as high into the night sky as he could get it. And there's the roar on the final whistle. Well, Crew have been a little bit hard done by here. They didn't deserve to lose this game that much, I would say, but it was very, very entertaining. And it's Forest Green who have nicked it right at the end. Forest Green 3, Crew 2.